A new medical device is changing the way cardiologists treat heart failure. In tonight's Living Well report, Suzanne Bruner shares how one man depended on it to save his life. While working on a roof in Camden, Mark Cook started to feel weak. Something I'd never felt before. I knew something was wrong, just a, a tightness, a, a discomfort, almost nauseating. And of all the days at work, it just so happened Mark's wife was there. She immediately rushed him to the emergency room. Doctors said Mark was having a heart attack and flew him to Baptist Health in Little Rock. They determined that I was in cardiogenic shock and knew that I had, by then, knew that I had the uh, blockage in the artery. The one device interventional cardiologist Thomas Conley turned to was the Impella heart pump. It circulates the blood for someone whose heart is not capable of circulating it. It's a small pump and it goes in through an artery in the leg or arm, passes up the aorta, goes around it and down into the heart. When you turn on the turbine, it circulates and basically sucks the blood out of the heart and ejects it through an exit port to circulate blood to the body. So you went from someone where you had less than 50-50 chance of living to where now you've got an 85% chance of walking out of the hospital. It's pretty dramatic stuff. The Impella heart pump has been used in Baptist Health for five years now and it's changing lives. The Impella made it possible for me to recover. Mark says the fact this kind of technology exists is amazing. In fact, he went to an event at the hospital to learn more about the device that saved his life. I'm fascinated by it now because, because it happened to me. Hmm.